Hi, let's see, how to obtain for free SSL certificates and how to install them for your Apache 2 web server in Linux Mint. Please note, before to start with this video, be sure you have already the Apache installed, and running on your Linux PC, with the default configurations, and HTTPS is activated and functional. If you don't have it, please watch my videos dedicated for that, you will find the link for the videos in the description. Let's understand for what are used SSL certificates. The SSL certificates, create an encrypted connection and establish trust. As you can see in the browser, if I want to access my web page, then it will announce me the connection is not secure, or it is not a trust source, and it will not let me to access that web page without granting special permissions, even if, you are using the secure protocol HTTPS. The most important part of an SSL certificate is that, it is digitally signed by a trusted CA, like DigiCert. Anyone can create a certificate, but browsers only trust certificates that come from an organization on their list of trusted CAs. Browsers come with a pre-installed list of trusted CAs, known as the Trusted Root CA Store. To solve this problem, please follow the next steps presented in this video. First step is to generate locally a CSR file. I prefer to have the certificates in the same folder with the application for which they are used. If there are more applications that are using same SSL certificates then we have a dedicated location in Linux for them. So, I will create the SSL underscore certificates folder in my Apache installation directory. Go to that folder to generate there the CRS file as follows. PEM pass phrase is used as a password when you start Apache server so, please save it, in a secure place. Next please complete each field with your information. Another important field is the common name, where you have to put your domain name without www or https. If this field is not well completed then, when the certificates will be generated you will have errors. Now is the time to generate free certificates files. For that please access go get SSL website. From there, create a new order and choose the free one that it is available for 90 days. Open your MyCSR file, generated before, and copy the contained text and paste it inside the box indicated by the website. Press Validate CSR button. Now you have to validate your domain. Please do that using HTTPS methods.
After next step button is pressed, please complete all the required field with your information then press complete generation. After press on domain validation, you will be redirected to the validation page. The validation file must be downloaded and placed in your Linux PC in such a way that when you click on the link from the bottom of the page, you should see the validation file content. First you have to create a specific folder structure inside of the folder where your index.html file is located. Then download the validation file and copy it inside of the folder P key validation. To see that folder, you have to check the box, show the hidden files. After everything it is done, go back to the website and press resend slash revalidate. Wait until the countdown ends, around 3 minutes. You can check if the first link from bottom of the page it is working, you should see the content of the validation file. If not, then the validation will fail. When the countdown ends, go to SSL certificates tab in the left. You should see your ordered certificates line there, with the status active. So then press view button, and your certificates files will be displayed in the upper right side of the page. Now it is the time to install those certificates. First download and copy them into your SSL underscore certificates folder, created at the beginning, in your Apache folder. Just do it like here. Now open the Apache configuration file, in my case Linux glass SSL.conf. Update the path to the default certification files, with the paths for certificates file that you have just obtained.
Restart the Apache server. And insert the PEM pass phrase when you are asked for. The PEM pass phrase is the phrase that you have set when the CSR file was generated. If everything was okay then check if your web page is recognized as a trusted web page. As you can see my web page is now a secure web page. Please leave a comment if something is missing or wrong. If this method worked for you, please give a like and subscribe to my channel for next useful videos of how to do it in Linux Mint. Thank you for watching.